Separated by just 11 miles, the rivalry between Dort University and Northwestern College and the NAIA has always been amongst the most heated in the region, with the exception of football. Though the 16-year-old Defender football program has had some close calls in recent years, they've never beaten the Red Raiders. Their most recent meeting, a 35-13 loss in Orange City last month. That meant the defenders couldn't possibly upset the defending national champs in their first ever playoff meeting in today's NAIA second round rematch, right? First quarter, it didn't look like they could. Northwestern, great opening drive. Third and 11, Jalen Gramstad to Connor McQuillan, Abel and Willen on a 12-yard score at 7-0 Northwestern. Those would be the only points, though, that Joel Penner's defense would allow. His offense, could they make up the difference? Second quarter, Colson Cruz to a diving. Connor can offer the first down. Defenders drive down to the Red Raider 2, elect to go for a field goal, except they botch the snap and they come away with nothing. It's 7-0 Northwestern at halftime. Matt McCarty's defense turns up the pressure in the third quarter. Cruz will get buried and sacked by Ben Kingery as the defenders go three and out, yet the Red Raiders could not capitalize as they managed just 155 total yards of offense. We go to the fourth quarter and it's crunch time. Cruz with a clean pocket this time, a 32-yard connection with Eli Bolden. The defenders would get down to the Red Raider one. However, they were pushed back to a fourth and goal from the two. Might be the play of the game, and it looked like there was confusion here. Except this is how they planned it. A direct snap to Nick Wellen on the reverse. Looked like he might have even wanted to throw this football, but it's strung out. He tries to bounce off a tackler and is stuffed by Clayton Bosma. Turnover on downs. Dort with one final chance, 119 to go. Fourth and long at midfield, Cruz's pass. Broken up by Cody Mosier and the defending national champs survive in advance in a slugfest, seven to nothing. I think it was a familiarity. You know, I think uh, having played each other a month ago, I think that gives the defenses an advantage the second time you play. And I thought our guys um, did a good job. You know, offensively, uh, we took care of the football. And that's a big, that's a big key in winning football games. And then defensively, uh, our guys played lights out and just got off the field when they needed to. The Red Raiders will host the quarterfinals next weekend and find out their opponent later tonight.